Okay, so let's go to the colony, make some good gear, and uh, let's destroy them. I should have went to the colony. Shit. I'm just gonna have a full an uh, entire room with a uh, chest for now. So we need a merchant. So let's see. Okay. I'll tell you what, I wasn't sure about the hula girl statues, but now when I see them, they feel kind of homely, so you know, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm coming around. See? It's still an obsession. You, you gotta be honest about it. Oh, I, look, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna deny that it's a problem. I also have a, uh, a glitch uh, statue if you want more figurines, by the way. I'll put it in your hula, hula factory. Okay, good. I mean, it'll stand out, I'm sure. I'm oh, sure yeah. Pick. Fits right there in. Yeah. Uh, let's see, do I have anything else? For the collection. Oh. I guess seeing as they don't want the teddy bear anymore, I might as well put the teddy bear in here, too. Oh, yeah, and of course yeah, this thing. Yeah, yeah, now we have a teddy uh, bear. What else do we have? How do I... Nope. I don't think How I have do I any other... How do drop stuff again? Oh, right. Um, how do you do what? Uh, drop stuff again. You, um... Q is the uh, drop button. If you oh, have, like, Q, you know, a rough bar. Well, then I'm gonna drop some, um... You could also just Tongue trash. If you have a trash can in your inventory. If you're, if you don't want to have some stuff, just kill it. Do you want this uh, tungsten? Uh, you want to set the table. Actually, you can it smelt might... the tungsten. You can smelt it. Yeah, it might oh. be kind of worth learning on your own. Uh, just, right. so you, yeah. just so you get, because I'm actually pretty good on materials. Oh, I need to go get vines. I'll be back. I'll so yeah, if you want to smelt tungsten, just use the uh, furnace down there. I mean, the ore system isn't hard. If you play Terraria, you'll you'll get this oh, yeah. too. It's super easy to work with. Alright, someone has the tungsten I just dropped in, because I put it on the table over here, but... It's fine. Let's see. I think this room is about done. Just gonna put a glitchy man on the wall. Ah... Uh... Vines regrow, right? Um, I'm not fully sure, actually. Hope they do. Well, I guess there's so roots fish. here. These roots should be good. Cotton actually, fiber. Yeah. You need vines for that, which is Sorry. what I'm going for. Should I just like pick up a bunch while I'm out here? Yeah, might as well. Oh, I found it. I think a ton. I don't know. Oh, I, I also got a bunch of seeds. If that's good, I've got like pineapple. Oh yeah, um, uh, we've got a garden over to the right. I think yeah, it's you, kind you of can a, just place them down. Yeah, just plant anywhere. As long as there's space. Uh, you do need to make a hoe at the foraging station. If you do want to be able to, like, hoe the ground and stuff. But you're going to need to do that anyway. Well, learn that? I don't know. It's kind of one of those where it's like, we could do it for you. Or it's, like, yeah, comically it's... easy to figure out. Yeah. Alright, what do I need then? Uh, okay. And you should have, like, almost every resource along the way. Okay. So this is gonna be a full storage house. Still no trader. Don't know why. It's just... They, they don't want to show up. Yeah. I mean, are they actually worth it? Do they actually have we, stuff? We can always sell stuff from our colony. Kinda That's cool. a good point. Go, made a mega closet. More chests on the ground. I've been watching the vines shake when uh when I'm like chopping them up. And if I like watch them too intensely, it actually makes it look like the rest of the world's kinda of shaking, and I'm like, this is really disconcerting. <laughs> I'm not a big fan Oh. Hey. You know that mushroom town that I like messed up earlier? Mm-hmm. Are they still alive? Yeah, they're still around. That's surprising actually. Yeah. They're still here. I think they have more equipment now. I mean, they've if you got, want to kill them, you can kill them. They've got big nasty looking swords. Which was a bit of a surprise to me. Are okay. they killing you? No, they're not killing me. I, I, I didn't actually try and fight them. It's just they had big swords and I was like, huh. I don't remember them being this well armed. Wow, that's actually kind of a nice looking pelican creature. Horribly colored, but still. It's a dense-ass forest over here. I, I felt guilty about not planting any trees, and then I, like, walk around and I'm like, never mind. There's too many things. Oh, and I'm starving. 
All right, done. Planted pineapple, potato, and two cocoa seeds. Oh, we need cotton wool, not... Uh, yeah, you turn the fiber into wool. I can actually make a bunch of that, I think. So if you need some... Uh, you yeah. Need... I'm gonna what are you doing with those eyeballs? <laughs> um, I still have some, I see. No, 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 no. Oh, we have a gate now. Okay, this is cool. So once we get wiring, we can actually wire up the gate so we approach it. It'll, it'll oh, just that's open. cool. Okay, throwing the eyeballs in the trash. Perfect. Some gnomes. Oh, you're, you're trashing them? Yeah. <laughs> Would you expect anything differently? Because... Yeah, we could make an eyeball forest or something. Uh, well, I've got the bones to go with them, so if you want to do it, I can do it. We can recreate hell over here as well. <laughs> I... Mm. Don't want. Okay, I need one more cotton wool. If you can make um, one I got for you. me. I got you. Okay. Because, yeah, I can have the full bandit set. Um, I think I had one Bing. here. Oop. I'm going to yep. need to clear my inventory tungsten. out. 72 tungsten bars. That'll do. That will do. So what do we need to upgrade? We need coal, glass, and tungsten to upgrade the uh, furnace over here. I'm going to make myself the new set. Ooh. I got a diamond. Ooh, keep that because you can actually hire penguins with them. Oh, so that's how you do it. Get some more cotton wool. Uh, let's see. Uh, go. I'm just gonna throw my Molotovs and throwing equipment yeah, yeah, just in do one of these boxes. It's fine. I figure you have more of a use for them than I do. I mean, oh. you can just throw the Molotovs against a building. Doesn't really set anything on fire. True. Be harm as long as you don't kill the chickens. Yeah. Oh Let's damn. See. Actually, come to think of it, I'll just go sell all of my all of my spare equipment. Let's see, what kind of tenant are we gonna get? I cannot get a trader. I don't know how. They they just don't want to. Oh, they don't want to. Now. Hmm. Go. Okay, we have a new person living here. A glitch. It's worth anything. They're not worth anything. Uh, I guess I'm good. I'm gonna go to the outpost. I need to sell some stuff as well. Yeah. You teleport away. I just walk over. Oh. Oh, yep. Interestingly enough, uh, we never used that teleporter for this session, so despite the fact that I've gone through that portal before, it counts yep. it as question mark, question mark, question mark, which is interesting. I think it always does it from that place. Uh, well, no, once you've gone through it for the first time in a zone, it'll, it'll actually... Um, it'll actually, like, tell you where you're going. Okay. Okay, so if we get a bunch of money, I can just... No, we don't need tungsten. Uh, tungsten. did anybody... Eh, I'll keep the boomerang for the time being. Let's see, 4, 2.3. Right, so you said that my ship's basically the best place to store all my kind of odds and ends and stuff? Yeah. Fine. Yeah, most of the... I other places we're gonna kind of be coming coming and going through and mm -hmm. so you're quickly just gonna like lose track of all your stuff yeah my inventory's all fucked already as well so i <laughs> sort this shit out yeah mine is oh god mine is so full well time to get rid of let's see flesh chunks I, I assume we can't turn the flesh chunks into something sellable right no 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 they're useless okay so I'll get rid of them and the packed bones, because, yeah, my, my blocks are starting to fill up pretty fast. It's like, do I need any of this stuff? No? So are Good. they selling cotton fiber? Oh, yeah, that'd be kind of handy. Yeah, there's, they're selling basically anything, but not cotton. Oh. Which is weird. That doesn't help. Uh, we're also gonna have to get fuel eventually from a moon. Yeah. And there's some uh, scary shit on moons. Oh, it could be fun. Eh, eh. Kind of horrifying. Let's see. Oh, jeez. So many things. I should probably just keep that around. Ah, damn. So if anyone has coal and glass, we can upgrade the furnace, and then okay. we can upgrade I the, uh... I think... 
I think I've got coal and glass. Uh, what's Which else be able to upgrade? Hmm. Oh, interesting. There's a. Uh, I didn't know that Terramart would buy crops from you. I don't want to touch yeah, that. For yeah, a yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, if you just want to make a lot of money by farming, that's the thing you can do. Is there anything else? Nope. Let's see. So what? What's the? Oh yeah, I guess the next goal is to find a new planet. I guess I could do that. I'm already hovering over the desert planet in our system, so we could just explore that one. Okay. I mean, if we're ready now, we can go there. Yep, I'll just be a second. I'm just sorting all this shit out. And I'm starving again. Ah. Okay, yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot of stuff to sort. I'm noticing. Oh, oops. Okay, I don't need any of these Pokemon. We can't even heal them up. Don't need this mask. This thing. Oh wait, so we kind of found something cool right away. Nice. Let's see. Uh, eh. Something cool is in something we want to immediately come running for. Well, no, nah, no. Nah, it was just a abandoned house with like oh. a chest down there. Okay. Well, I'll be with you in a second. Oh. So it is. That was actually a second. It's <laughs> very surprising. I I am not a very prompt person unless it means nothing. Then I'm very prompt. I guess actually we got started at a good time today. Scheduling things with uh, with people I've never met before is always kind of an interesting challenge. It's like, yes. is this one of those people that's like habitually late? I don't know. <laughs> I'm just going to bet on no. Actually, have you guys done a whole lot of, like, collaborative stuff? I haven't seen much no. on, like, either Not of really. you. Okay. Not a crazy ton here, no. So I was, like, super social when it came to starting my channel. It's like, I need to meet people. Um, I've learned how to make thorn juice. That doesn't sound appetizing. Um, I'm also, like, super nervous. I, I think I mentioned this to you, Gull, last time, but, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm super nervous when it comes to, like, new people, especially people that I, like... See, it's like larger than me or better than me. So, like, uh, Tom specifically, you've always been the roguelike channel that's been like outpacing me. So I'm like, I'll talk to him Wait, someday. You, you've, you've taken the lead though. You've taken I, the lead. In the I last have. Couple months? It's all like scrap mechanic and Fallout. And I'm like, well, roguelikes. <laughs> Yo, then... Fallout man, Fallout always does nuts for numbers. Uh, what's his name again? Many a true nerd. Yes. I remember when they started it and they got like, what, 50,000 subs in the space of like, what, a couple of months? Yeah. And I've uh, been doing it like a year and a half and I was like, damn you, damn you. Yeah, but, I you saw know. that and I was like, I am jealous. But I was also thinking, it's like, I'm not entirely sure if I could do that sort of thing. And then the, I'm doing yeah. that sort of thing now. It's like, <laughs> well. <laughs> nah, I, I've been branching out a bit as well. There comes a time when you're like, you know, roguelikes can only get you so far. I, um, my main problem is I just haven't had any that I'm like been stoked for. Like Gungeon was fun, but it was too it was too RNG for me. So yeah. after a while, I like lost interest in it because like I could probably get to be on your level eventually, but it's like eh. I'll tell I, you what looks cool. The game is coming out on the sixteenth of August. Um, Monsters and Monocles. Yes, I've already requested a copy. I spent yeah. I think an hour talking to the developers at PAX East. I was like. Uh, I just showed up and I was like, oh, I know you guys. And then we just sat there uh, talking because they, uh, the place they'd like put their, um, the, what am I going to say? Their, their, their setup was like in a really weird spot. Um, and so like nobody was coming by because Necropolis was like right next to them. Right. And so they were just bored and I was like, all right. I have nothing better to do. Let's just talk with these guys. So wait, it's a new roguelike? Yeah, it's uh, a. Yeah. Ac actually, uh, if you get a copy, the three of us could play it. It's got online mul multiplayer straight from the get go. Okay. Hopefully it works. Hopefully the, the online multiplayer works. So uh, what, what kind of style? Like Isaac or is it like uh, nuclear throne gungeon, but like more yeah. casual? Oh. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Oh, Florians. Oh, you found them? Yeah. Ooh. Well, that's super lucky, actually. I, I think they're Florians. They might not. They look like Florians. They've got like caveman y stuff. Yeah, that, that's them. The, the Florians are cannibalistic by nature, and their style oh. is just caveman people. Wonderful. 
Well, I scanned, I think, everything. We found a random guy living on a hill. What are you doing? He's got yeah, nothing yeah. to say. Good. This is um, just a straight I up... Guess... Oh, I got it. I got the clue. Yeah, I guess we can uh, teleport over, then. Let's see. This is a pretty elaborate structure. Like, this is, I think, the largest town uh, I've seen. So it's actually a town? Oh, it's yeah, it is. Yeah, freaking yep, massive. Yep. This is cool. So make sure to loot everything, because they have a lot shit. of cool shit. There's like a purpley orb thing in here. What's this? A teleporter core. Yeah, we can turn those into uh, just teleporters. This keeps going up and up. So, you said they're cannibals? Yeah, they're cannibalistic by nature. But, I mean, if you don't piss them off, it's all good. However, we are going to rob every, oh, yeah, absolutely. every box and barrel. see you, it's fine, though. What was it? Oh, I guess the chest was already looted. Yeah, I, I, I've already I've already looted the um, extent of this. Don't forget to scan things. Oh, crap, I forgot the top four. I've scanned most everything, but I'm mm. not entirely sure. You, no. um, at times, you need, like, a second floor in settlement to... Get you the mission. Ooh, the bookcase. Suck. That was one. Oh, got one. Got it. Okay, uh, cool. No, never mind. Uh, there's a bookcase down here. It's also a quest. Wow. We really do have to scan like a dumb amount of things. So I think um, we found a good village at least. Oh yeah, absolutely. So roasted mushrooms give you a health bonus. E um, I think so. Maybe. So you, you can see the buff beneath your uh, stamina bar. Yeah, yeah, health bonus it says, apparently. Okay, nice. cool. Just basically, the, the better the food you make, the more buffs you'll get. This is scannable up? Oh. Yep, this is scannable. Didn't, doesn't look like any of this is particularly usable, though. Oh, that is. Oh, that trophy <laughs> that trophy's worth a lot. Yeah, but we, we kind of got to wait for uh, Tom to scan, scan it first. Yeah. Ooh. No, no, I mean, I mean, worth a lot in terms of quest pro progression. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not grabbing things, especially not scannable stuff. That's Ooh, that'd be bad. should I take right should I take quests from people or should I leave? Yeah, them you might as well. You, you right. can pick them up. Where are we at? What the fuck? Wow, this place keeps going. Oh, you're up there. Oh, oh god, I think my connection is hiccuping. Oh yeah, I'm it's noticing perfect. that. Oh god. Okay, there we go. There cool. we go. Woo. All right, good. So you were. Oh, okay. Because oh, that was weird as fuck. So on my screen, it like the world had ended on that side. It was like a huge cliff. <laughs> so where's the scannable fella? Uh, so you know how to? Oh. Yeah, yeah. Of course you know how to scan. Uh, um, there's it a be ton. In this one over here, in this tree over here, and then up there, this one. Ah, uh, jeez. This place does not stop though. I think this is. It should be this. Oh, yep. There we go. If we're lucky, we don't need to find, like, a second floor in the uh, village. Uh, found another thing. No chest up here, though. Oh, they keep closing the doors on me. I'm like, why is it so hard to get... Oh... I'll be honest, I think the progression in Starbound so far has impressed me more than Terraria. Yeah, oh yeah. I like there this... just being, you know, actual tangible things to do that are not, you know, get loot, then kill boss, then get loot, then yes. kill boss. I will admit this it, it's is... It's more based on exploration this time around. This is a little bit on the tedious side. Scan everything. It's like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, uh, we've hit the end of the village. Did we get all of it? Or did no. we need, like, something else? Okay, well, I guess we go yeah, on. Yeah, I'm, I'm like two-thirds of the way there. Well, I guess we keep going. I mean, we should, probably should find another one. Not as big as the Glitch Super Castle. Sort of, but like, the Super Castle is kind of like a mini dungeon. This was, like, much more... Yeah, just a village. Yeah. They didn't have any traders, though. That's a yeah. shame. They had one quest. I should probably... Pop that one on. Challenger? No. Uh, Glitch Thieves. Track quest. Oh, what the hell is this? That's a trader. Oh, that's cool. Is that Helmut Betcher? 
Bacon ropes. Bacon ropes and a tracker's helm. Uh, that tracker's helm is tier one, so it shouldn't be better than a tungsten thing. Oh, wait, no, Actually, it's, no, that's it's tier, tier two. two. Yeah. Yeah, that, that is tungsten, I think. Hmm. So, not worth getting the tracker's helm? Probably not. Um, you, you can kind of get it, it um, unless you already have tungsten. I mean, if you think but it I looks... Mean, if you think it looks nice... At home. I'm just gonna buy a lot of bacon, so I don't need to worry about food. Does the bacon come pre-cooked? No, oh. you're still gonna cook it. Ah. <laughs> oh. But I want free bacon or easy bacon. You like a bacon farm going on? Now I'm just hungry. <laughs> oh shit! You guys probably have been awake for a while. I woke up like yeah. half an hour before this. Before this, I was like on a six-hour Pokemon hunt still, because I'm still playing that. Uh, I'm not stopping. I'm still playing Pokemon Go. I yep. I can't get into it. I don't have um, I don't have data. Uh, oh right. Yeah, that can suck. Yeah, I I've never needed it because I'm kind of a homebody. Uh, so it's just like eh, I don't really feel like paying the extra money. So my smartphone works great on Wi-Fi, but the moment mm -hmm. I'm like, I gotta go catch a something or other. Yeah, for me it was already in the bundle, so I was like, okay, let's go outside, see if this is something. And now I yeah, go outside because of Pokemon. I feel like you get shafted quite a lot across the pond when it comes to like stuff like mobile data, because we, like, in the UK, we get, like, unlimited data for, you know, like, say, a five and a month on your phone bill, and, you know, it is, like, actually unlimited. It might slow down sometimes, but it's, like, you know, yeah, always there for you. I guess it's because you have a much smaller country to deal with. Yeah, true, true. I'm excited. I'm moving halfway across uh, the country so I can get Google Fiber soon. So suddenly oh, I'll be going What's from. But yeah, that's what I would like as well. Yeah. Google what's the Fiber. What's the speeds in uh, in like the UK? And uh, mine's 75 down, 30 up. Um, but you can get up to 135 down and 50 or 80 up. Um, on just like your regular BT or Sky Internet or whatever you want. I should have huh. like 200 down, but most of the time it's half of that. I've got a quest to kill glitch thieves. And I yes, killed... Same. I killed most of them. But now the compass is insane in telling me to go find an invisible one. <laughs> Okay, so we're back yep. at the guy who lives on a mountain, so I guess that's this planet, really. Unless you guys want to dig into it, or we just go to a new floor, forest planet. Um, uh, it's up to you. Eh, eh, Let, eh. Let's keep going, maybe? I don't know. Splunk? Yeah, we can Splunk. Okay, I'll teleport to you guys. I mean, if you if you want to go to a new planet, that's cool. But we do have to go to a mine. Uh, to a moon, Jesus. Uh, would... No... We need the backpack thing. Can we make one of those? I think we have the resources to do so now. Yeah. Because it's just tungsten and we have over 200 bars. Okay. So let's go make those make backpacks. Can I just wear one of those? Presumably. The, the backpacks? Yeah, breathing EPP. Yeah, you, you wear them. They're okay. your back item. I, I was worried that they'd like break or something. I always hate like oh, no, the no, no, no. breakable equipment. Probably looks dumb though. So I made uh, three right oh. now. You can actually just overlay your cape. So one over here. Do make sure that you have them in your, in your active back slot, and not the social one. So it actually works. Mm. So I've got one for you as well, Wander. Do, I so we should okay. be fine for a moon. Yeah, I've got the I got the backpack. Uh. Oh, you got so, it already. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I already made one. So that's all we need. We don't need to worry about spacesuits or shit like that. It's just the yeah. The now we can breathe underwater and everything. Ooh. Oh, even underwater. Yeah, yeah. Oxygen, wow. Always. Awesome. That's fast. It's the future. I can cook my bacon. Okay. Can can somebody have like a portable stove top to go along with this? Cause uh, that'd be handy. Let's see. Goal. You want to pick out a moon? Um, sure. Uh, if you if somebody has like one more silver bar though, we can upgrade the architect's table, and then we oh. can make more crafting stations. I yeah. should have one. Uh, I think I have a bunch. Let's see. Go glitch timer. Yeah, I've got two here. Oh, there you are. 
Let me see. Upgrade. Uh, I so don't my... have glass. Give me a and second. And boom. Oh, you so already So now got it? we can make a fossil station, which I'm going to do right away. Oh, neat. We can make a refinery, which turns, I think, what, what did it do? Yeah, we can turn raw ore into pixels. Or no, raw pixels into ores. Wait, what? No, no, from ores, from ores. Oh yeah, from ores, you're correct. I misread. And here's the fossil station. So if we, if we make brushes, we can start a museum. Okay, is nice. there a difference between an advanced fossil brush and a normal one? Faster? Yeah, the higher ones are better, but just better in general. Okay. I'll so go get some strings so I can make a master one. Some master ones, yep. Advanced ones. Okay, cool. Are fossils used for anything apart from just looking nice? They look nice, yeah. That's it. Okay. Uh, that's, that's it looks all, like but... it. It looks like Tom is ready to go to the moon. I certainly am. I'm well prepared. <laughs> Still do not like that helmet. It's it's too big. <laughs> it's yeah. There's, there's something about it. it's not quite right. Yo, uh, what armor that's... do you guys have? Are you up to? I'm on like two pieces of tungsten now. Uh, do you need more? We need some plasma have... fiber to make him uh, as well. <laughs> Currently, I have protective trousers, protective shirt, and the Vetro's mask. So I'll need to do a little upgrade. I think. Um, let's see. Do, does anyone have cotton fiber? I do not. Things? I have oh, one I have cotton one? fiber. Oh wait, I have six cotton fiber seedlings. Okay, so I'm just gonna plant those before we go. Okay. There we go. Uh, this shit is not gonna fit on my ship, is it? Oh wait, yeah, well, I just have to move it up. There we go. I'm trying to keep my ship upgraded with the with the uh, the same benches and whatnot. Uh, cause yeah, I'm kind of ignoring that right now. Well, you know how to do it. I I figure I'm gonna forget otherwise. And this is kind of handy if we're out and about and I don't want to go back all the way to the colony. We have a kitchen counter now, so we can actually make not shit food. Yeah, like bread. Or dumplings, or jam, or let's see. Oh shit. Chocolate. Popcorn. What the fuck are fluffy roughs? I have no clue, but I think it's potato stuff? Seem oh, yeah. tasty. Egg and- oh, it's eggy bread, basically. Ah. I can make bloody pus. Uh, I mean, hmm. great. <laughs> okay, I made too much bread. I think I made too much bread. Is it like a refrigerator? Yes, we can actually make one. Um, let me check right now. So there's a mini fridge. We need one static cell, which we can get from a uh, electric fluffalo. Okay. Which we don't have just yet. So I actually have a ton of food now, which is kind of nice. Yeah. I my inventory is full. Yeah, same. Okay. Perfect. Oh, I can make bandages. Good stuff. Yeah, we, oh wait, the healing station. Do we have that yet? I uh I have one. If you want me to bring it down, you well, should be able well, to make I, one. I can make one over here for like five bottles, so we should be good. Okay. What else is there? Poison. Poison antidote. Oh. Eh. Probably not super necessary. Boom, there we go. Now we can make some good healing items. Okay. And it's woven fabric. So do we have to leave the, uh, do we have to leave the sol this solar system to start getting, like, titanium? Or will we possibly get well, that? Well, yeah, our system mode? does not have titanium. Okay. 